Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm Kanisha with Currency Queen Budgets. In this video, I will be doing my monthly closeout for March 2023. If that is something you're interested in, stay tuned. All right, guys, so you know I will be working in my Queen's Budget by Paycheck, the 2023 edition. This book can be found on my online store, which is www.currencyqueenbudgets.com. Um, we are going to jump right into um, the end of March and see what we were able to to say for um this month so what i'm going to do i'm going to get my categories filled in and i will be right back all right so i have everything written down and we are going to do a little counting. So what I'm going to start with first is my change. So I can get this out of the way. We're going to do my change. And this is how much change we have for this month. And we're just going to add it to my... Um, digital coin jar and I'm just going to drop it in there and that way I can get that off my desk and then I'm going to do my one dollar for um March so this is a one dollar challenge for March 2023 and i'm just thinking about it i don't know what i did with my envelopes from last year i could have kept those and just reused those instead of pulling out um some new envelopes i'm gonna have to look and see i may have thrown them away i'm not sure but what i'm going to do is take out my ones from my one dollar savings challenge and i am also going to take out the ones from here as well Although this is for, um, these is what I saved for my monthly challenges for, I mean, my savings challenge for next, next month for March, I mean for April, but I'm going to just go ahead and get those since I did have those left over and I'm just going to put those in my $1 savings challenges as well because we're gonna start fresh with April as far as the savings challenges. I was like rolling over money from um, from each month for savings challenges and I think I'm just going to stop that. And if I do have a lot of ones at the end of the month, I'm just going to continue to do it this way. seal this until um, it's time to open it. So I'm going to write this here too so I'll know. It's March 2023. Okay. So I have that. I'm just going to set that to the side as well. Um, did I forget this one? Okay, so now let's jump into our A5 and see what we have. So for our emergency funds, I'm not going to count this 1500 because that's in... Um, my online savings account and I did have someone to ask me 
where I had my online savings account and I have it through Ally um, and it does accrue interest. I think that was one of the questions as well, but yeah, I do have uh, my online banking through Ally. So I started with $35. So let's see what we have here. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 37, 39, and 40. So I have 100 and Forty dollars. I just wrote forty. One hundred and forty. All right. So for my ten dollars savings challenges, <clears throat> I have. Um, I know this is six six hundred and thirty dollars. But I will go ahead and count it again. So I have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 91, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 3, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 94, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 6, 10, 20, 30. So that is $630. And For my taxes, I have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, 210. And we have nothing in our $20 savings challenge in as far as the A5. Okay, so next is for fun. And we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, and 58. So that is $158. And that is for my scratch offs. For bingo, I have a total of 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. For just do it, I have 510. 12, 14, 16, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. So this also has 25. And that is all for my A5 savings challenges. So the next thing we're going to do is my $1,000 challenge. And we did complete that. So we have $1,000 in here. Just want to flip through and show you that all the envelopes are complete. And I will be doing this challenge again once we unstuff that. So um, end in balance here is $1,000. And then for my um, March monthly savings challenge. Let's see what we have here. Okay, for March, we have seven 
So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. That's 75. 77, 79, 81, 83, 85, 87, 89, 91, 93, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200, 1, 2, 3, and 4. I feel like I counted that wrong, but I'm going to go back and count it. So I have... 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 97, 99, 201, okay, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. Okay, so I did miscount it, and I have $224. $224. Okay, and... I did have, um, I did do my scratch and save. I'm going to write that in. And that was started with zero for March. And I finished that with $500. Um, but... I did take that money out for my vacation, but I did save that 500, but I think I am going to put zero here because I did pull that out. So I don't want to add that in my, um, well, I guess I put it here for my end balance. I don't know how I want to do that. Yeah. So I'm going to put it for the difference and see how much we actually saved. Or do I just not want to put it on there? Hmm. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it in the beginning balance because I did have it in the beginning, but I don't have it now. So that's what I'm going to do. No, y'all, I don't know. I'm just not going to add it in. How about that? I'm just not going to add it in because I don't have it. I did save it, but I used it. Okay, so let, let me add this total up to see how much we actually saved. Um, so I have 140, 630, 210, 158, 25, 25, um, 1,000, 224, 500. So that is a total of 2,000. $912, but I'm going to subtract that 500 and then I'm going to do $2,412. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to figure out the difference and see how much I actually save for March. So this is the total that we ended up with. So we're going to do 140 minus 35. So we did um, $105 in our emergency funds for um, $10 savings challenge, $630 minus $260. So we saved a total of $370. 20s get zero. $210 minus $50. I have $160. $158 minus $83 is 75, 25 minus 5, that's 20. So I'm going to write 20 on both. 1,000 minus 400, that is 600. 
and this would be 224. So let's see how much we saved. 105 plus 370. 75, 20, 20. So we saved a total of $1,574 for the month of March. And that is great. I am excited about that total. But guys, that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, guys, I hope you consider hitting that like and subscribe button, hitting that notification bell, and um, leave me a comment. But as always, guys, I hope that you have a blessed day, a blessed week. Until my next video, I want you guys to hustle hard, budget hard, and pray harder. Be blessed, Queenies. Bye.